Hey there, viewers. Cooking your own food is the first major step towards achieving your weight loss goals. It can be frustrating at times, especially when things don't turn out the way you expect them to be. This is what life hacks are for. In today's video, we'll be talking about the 23 kitchen hacks that'll change your life. Tips for easier meal prep and better cooking for weight-conscious dieters. Why should you opt for cold pasta? What about adding coconut oil to your boiling rice water? We'll be talking all this and more. Number 1. Crack eggs on the countertop Do you often cook eggshells into your omelette? Like a stray piece of shell that somehow sneaks into your mix? Don't you worry, there are easy hacks to prevent this. Your omelettes and eggs will all turn out fine without any traces of eggshells. Just make sure you crack the eggs right on the counter. When you crack them on the side of your bowl, there is a high risk that a few eggshells might fall into your food. How do you like your eggs? Runny or hard-boiled? Sunny side up or scrambled? Share your preferences with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number 2. Microwave garlic for 10 seconds for easy peeling I don't know about you, but I absolutely hate peeling garlic. It's one of the most intense jobs in the kitchen. Even peeling peas sounds better. If you're like me, you'll appreciate this easy hack. Microwave garlic for 10 seconds and then peel them. You'll be surprised how easy it is now. No microwave? No problem. Place garlic cloves on a cutting board or clean countertop. Smash it a bit with your fist or the back of your knife. Now peel it. It'll just take a few seconds. Number 3. Wash cottage cheese under running water Are you conscious of the amount of sodium you eat every day? Well, you need to know this. Even bland cottage cheese contains high amounts of salt. It's added as a preservative and to enhance the texture and flavor. If you can't find low-sodium versions, rinse it under running water for at least 15 minutes. Experts recommend doing this as the sodium content gets reduced by 63%. Number 4. Store leftover sliced potatoes in water So you were making a potato dish and overestimated the ingredients you'll need. Now you have raw sliced potatoes you don't want to throw away. But keeping them as is can't be an option. Raw cut potatoes will turn brown pretty soon. I get your problem. But there's an easy hack to save the situation. Store these potatoes in a bowl of cold water. Make sure they're completely submerged. Store them in the fridge, but use them within 24 hours. You can also boil them and store them in the fridge. They will easily last you two to three days. Make mashed potatoes for dinner the next day. Number 5. Store strawberries as is. Are you a strawberry fan? So am I. They're loaded with vitamin C, but be careful with how you store them. If you slice them all at once just to store, then stop. Vitamin C is sensitive to light and heat. It gets destroyed easily when it comes in contact with atmospheric oxygen. They'll also lose some of their antioxidants. So instead of slicing them all together, store strawberries as they are. The same goes for oranges, no peeling and storing. Number 6. Better storage for avocados This is essential. There's just one rule. Unripe avocados belongs on your countertop. While the ripe ones, they go in the fridge. By letting unripe avocados sit outside your counter, you're allowing it to ripen faster. Wondering how to tell if your avocados are ripe? If you can easily pop the button off the top of an avocado? Number 7. Frozen lemon juice cubes Lemons are great, especially when you get them cheap. Don't worry, you don't need to pickle them if you don't want to. There's an easy hack to make sure you have lemon juice throughout the year. Juice all the lemons, then freeze the cubes in ice trays. There, you have your lemon ice cubes. Add them to your drinks or melt them when you need lemon juice. Number 8. Cold pasta is better. Do you love pasta? Here's a hack to help you eat your favorite pasta without worrying about weight. Eat it chilled. Seriously. Chill your pasta overnight and eat it the next day. It's okay to reheat it. Cold pasta keeps you full for longer compared to being cooked and served immediately. Number 9. Freeze blueberries. Can you make healthy fruits even healthier? Of course you can. Blueberries are super nutritious thanks to their antioxidants. Their skin is heavily concentrated with antioxidant properties. Freezing them will make them even better for you. Wondering how? The freezing process forms ice crystals on blueberry skin. This makes the antioxidants more available to your body. Number 10. Add oil to boiling rice. There's a trick to make rice healthy for you. Just add a teaspoon of coconut oil to boiling water before cooking rice. 
it'll have 10 times more resistant starch. But how does that make things better? Well, resistant starch is digested slowly, so you'll feel full for longer. Your blood sugar levels will be more stabilized. No unbearable cravings. Eventually, you'll end up eating less calories. Number 11. Poached eggs are healthier. Eggs are already incredibly healthy. But did you know that the way you eat them affects the nutrition you get? The best way is poached. Crack open an egg in a pot of simmering water. There, you have your poached eggs. You absorb up to 50% more nutrients from runny yolk compared to hard-boiled yolk. Before we move ahead, here's a video you might like. Watch and learn more about 11 foods people eat that can kill you. Number 12. Toasted bread is better. There's a way you can make your healthy sandwiches even healthier. Of course, adding grilled chicken breast and avocados is just great. But don't forget to toast your bread. Experts say toasting bread reduces its glycemic index. The lower the glycemic index, the higher the satiety. This means you'll feel fuller for longer and your blood sugar levels won't crash. You can also freeze your bread before toasting. Your body will absorb even less glucose from frozen bread than toasted. Number 13. Cooked tomatoes are healthier. Do you love tomato soup and sauce? Here's a reason to love them even more. Whenever you get a chance, make sure you eat tomatoes in cooked form. Roasting and cooking increases the level of powerful compound in tomatoes. This powerful compound lowers your risk of heart disease and cancer. A study has found that people who ate sauce cooked for 40 minutes had 55% more of the compound in their blood. Number 14. Patience is the key, my friend. It's really difficult to let your delicious steak rest right after being cooked. The temptation is just too much. But you have to keep your patience. If you slice into the meat just after cooking, the juices will escape. Wait 5 to 10 minutes, let the juices settle, and then take a bite into your burger or steak. In case you're craving a large roast, wait at least 15 minutes. Number 15. Flip your meat often. Nobody likes eating uneven steak or chops. If you're wondering how to make sure your steak is evenly cooked, there's a very simple way. Flip the meat as often as you can. Try one flip per minute. Not only will the meat cook faster, It'll also cook evenly. Number 16. Go to farmer's market early. Want to get your hands on the best produce? Then go to the local farmer's market early in the morning. You'll be the first to pick the freshest products. Number 17. Get more fruit juice. Tired of squeezing through limes, lemons, and oranges only to be disappointed from the low volume? You get more fruit juice with this trick. Microwave for 15 seconds right before juicing you'll get twice as much juice. Number 18. Ice water will liven up your leafy greens. It used to happen a lot with me. I would buy fresh kale, spinach, and parsley, then store them in the fridge. But when I would get to them later in the week, all my fresh greens would be wilted. Not anymore. You can rescue your aging produce by giving them an ice water bath before cooking. Green leafy veggies spoil due to loss of moisture. Ice water easily penetrates their cells, restoring them. Number 19. Opt for in-season produce. I cannot recommend this enough. Always get fruits and veggies that are in season. They're better than the cold storage products you get all year round. In-season produce is fresh and cheap. Plus, they're healthy for you. Number 20. Experiment with ingredients. Cooking is an art. Just like you experiment with colors and music, experiment with ingredients. Do not stick to recipes as they're not set in stone. If you don't have eggplants right now, you can substitute them for mushrooms. Tofu can be a substitute for cottage cheese if that's what's in your refrigerator right now. You might even make something better by switching the ingredients. You only need to understand the basic techniques and know which foods taste good together. Number 21. Pay attention to your plate's temperature before serving. Not paying attention to the temperature before serving food is a rookie mistake. If you're serving warm food, heat your dishes in the oven for 10 minutes at 150 degrees Fahrenheit. Do this right before plating the meal. In case you're serving cold dishes, chill your plates lightly. This will preserve the freshness of your cold food. Number 22. Trick to get crispy chicken without frying. Even the thought of crispy chicken skin makes my mouth water. But frying is a no-go if you're health conscious. 
does that mean you need to give up on crispy chicken? Well, of course not. Here's what you do. Buy a whole chicken the day before cooking. Sprinkle a teaspoon of kosher salt on it. Store it uncovered in the refrigerator. Salt and air will draw out the extra water. Before you cook this chicken, pat it dry with a paper towel. You'll definitely get crispy chicken skin after cooking. Number 23. Time your salt. Adding salt to your dish is an art in itself. You need to know the correct amount to add as well as when to do it. As for the amount of salt, trust your mouth. Don't go by the standard recipe as each one of us has a different palate, taste, and adjust. Don't use a salt shaker as it won't give you accuracy. Instead, use a bowl and a spoon so you know the actual amount you're adding. Now comes the question about when to add salt. If you're cooking pork, chicken, or turkey, season them up to eight hours before cooking. This will give the salt enough time to penetrate the meat. You'll get a juicier, full seasoned meal. But if you're making burgers, season just before grilling them. If the salt's left on longer, it'll break down the protein strands. As a result, you'll get tougher burger patties. Knowing kitchen hacks can be a lifesaver. You save precious time along with cooking even more delicious food. How about some more hacks? Watch 19 tips on how to clean faster and better. You can also try 10 life hacks to get a good night's sleep. Go ahead and click one. Better yet, watch both. Did you know about any of these 23 kitchen hacks before? Let us know in the comments below.